I'm here in YouTube. So if I want to edit one of my videos, first I need to upload it. Then I'm going to go to the little drop down arrow, next to upload, and I can get to the video manager. From the video manager, I'm able to find the video that I had recorded, and I notice that there's an edit button. The drop down arrow next to the edit button will allow me to do a variety of things, one of which is to create annotations. So this is going to actually play through the video. I can add annotations, which are basically just sticky notes. So I want to point out certain things in the video. So you notice that it's playing, but I can pause the video. And then I can pull the scrubber to the point in the video where I'd want to put my note. I'm going to hit pause. So if I want to put a sticky note right here, let me click on this and get rid of the old one. I just click on Add Annotation. I'm going to click Add Annotation. It does give me several different types of annotations or sticky notes that I can add. I'm going to just do a speech bubble right here. And in this particular moment, this video is looking at need an equal sign for formula. So I'm able to type in what I want the sticky note to say. I can move it around the video. I'm going to have it be right there. And if I come down to the bottom, I can see that that sticky note is only going to last for a few short seconds. This is the timeline of my entire video, and so my note only shows up for a little bit. So if I hover over the edge, I'm actually able to pull it and have the sticky note last on screen for longer. So let's move this over so you can see how this works. You notice it's playing, and now it hits the sticky note, and it's playing through. You notice the sticky note is still on screen, and then as it approaches the edge, it's going to disappear. And there it goes. So I'm able to point out different things using the sticky notes. Push pause. I can actually add another one. So let's go ahead and do a speech bubble. And on this one, I'm going to say, double clicked on that, use dollar signs for the formula. And where do I want this annotation? I can actually notice I can move it over. I can slide the annotation in place. I can have it be at the same time as the other annotation. And I can stretch it out to vary the length of how long the annotation lasts on the screen. So the idea is to be able to go through your video and use text to point out different pieces of the video that you want to draw the attention of the viewer to. When you're done, you're going to hit Save and Publish.